Platinum reporter Spencer Wilson covers the stories impacting our high country. Spencer, you were at the training, and, you know, the law is pretty simple. That's right, Jim. Basically, if your commercial vehicle have tire chains on you between September 1st and May 31st, so long as you are west of the city. And that basically makes sure that they're always available to have chains in the event a winter storm pops up in that time frame, which we know they might, and they will always be prepared. The rules are you have to make a stop today in Georgetown if you're a trucker. Just to make sure you know the rules. Hopefully you won't need them. Because some of our truckers driving through don't. Oh no, we're from Florida. Florida. Definitely no chain laws down there. No, no chain laws. <laughs> Today's education, but enforcement is coming. And so is the snow. Soon it won't just be a friendly reminder. So those who don't have chains or don't know how to put them on need to learn. To put them on? Yeah. No, we got to go on YouTube. And there can be any number of reasons why people decide they don't need chains. Sometimes it's hubris and bravado, thinking they can master it. Sometimes they don't want to take the time. Maybe they don't know how to do it. Ultimately, there's no good excuse. There's no good reason. And that's what we're trying to prevent is the, the catastrophes from happening before they do. Because we know what the wrecks look like in the winter. Chains or no chains. Chains can be the difference between life and death, especially when we're talking bad weather. It doesn't take much for any type of vehicle to go off the road, to block lanes. The fines and citations can be significant, but ultimately what we're worried about is keeping everybody in that cab and everybody around that truck as safe as possible. Now, state troopers said they did not give out any tickets to people who did stop. There were multiple signs telling people to stop, but if they blew by, then, then they also didn't have chains. Those people actually might have gotten a citation today. It is just that time of year again. Snow potentially around every corner. We'll just have to listen to our meteorologists back in the studio. Live in Summit County, Spencer Wilson covering Colorado first. Keeping us safe on the roads. Thank you, Spencer. And this is just one example of how Spencer covers our high country for you. And he wants to hear your story ideas. If you have one, give Spencer a call at 303-863-TIPS. That's 303-863-8477. Or you can email Spencer through cbscolorado.com.